Welcome back to Google Guru. For those of you that haven't joined us before, I just wanted to let you know that Google Guru is an informational video series where we'll teach you how to do a lot of different things in Google Apps, including everything from basic to pretty advanced tasks. Today we're going to talk about something pretty basic, but something that I know is very important to uh, many users, and that's setting up a signature in Gmail. It's a pretty easy thing to do. So from within your Gmail inbox, you're going to want to go to the top right hand corner of the page where you see the socket. Click on that and you'll see mail settings and mail help as well as labs pop down. You want to click on mail settings. There's a lot of different things you can change in mail settings and we'll cover most of them in different videos, but for your signature, you want to scroll about two thirds of the way down the page. You can see here in the middle of my screen, there's a signature box. There's two radio buttons you can check one for no signature and one if you want a signature. I've already put in a sample text-based signature here with my name, our address, my phone number, and the name of our company. Um, there's a lot of different things you could do. You can you know, style the text, bold, italics, underline. You can choose different fonts, different sizes, and you can actually put any type of HTML in here. Um, one thing I'll show you how to do is add an image. So I went ahead and uploaded um, a little Facebook icon to our website and I can insert that image here. Now you have to have, you can't upload images straight from your desktop, you have to upload them so that they're hosted elsewhere first. But here's the URL of my image and there it is. And then I can link that to our Facebook page and we'll be good to go. That's it for uh, creating a signature. Thanks for joining us today, and you can always find us at googleguru.com. Thanks again.